My name is Becky Gray. I'd like to tell you about Renaissance's YR8C SPB Demo Kit. The YR8C SPB is one of three subatomic particle boards made by Renaissance that integrates an E8 emulator and a debugger circuit in one small circuit board. There are three subatomic particle boards, one for each of the microcontroller families, the R8C, the M16C, and the H8 family. What sets this kit apart from other kits, other than its interactive abilities and attractive user interface, is that it is not made to develop your design and program your parts. Rather, it demonstrates the capabilities of Renaissance, Renaissance's integrated development environment, Hue, and the R8C family of microcontrollers. This small round demo board has very helpful labels on the front and links to websites that offer more help on the back. It comes with some somewhat uncomfortable headphones and its own USB cable. The best thing about this kit is that there is no manual to read before you can use it. All you have to do is let the CD auto run and it will install the software that you need and give you simple instructions to get your system up and running. I found that the installation process went very smoothly, but when I exited and restarted the tutorial, it didn't recognize that I already had Hue installed and proceeded to reinstall it. The subatomic particle board consists of about a dozen modules made of one or more videos each. Only one of the modules is mandatory, the hardware and software verification module. This and a few others are interactive with Hue and cannot be fast forwarded or skipped through. Many modules lack navigation arrows that I feel would be very helpful when problems arise. But overall, the tutorial is designed to be very easy to follow, as long as you don't get ahead of the instructions and just let it set the pace. If you do find that you get lost or stuck, there are helpful troubleshooting options along the way. There are two groups of people who will most likely be using this demo kit. Design engineers, who want to learn how to use Renaissance, and engineering managers, who need to decide if Renaissance is right for them. The engineering managers will find the following modules helpful. Renaissance Overview, What's Cool About Hue, Training Resources, Document Updater, What's New, What's Next, Buy Now, and Third Party Suppliers. Design engineers, who want to learn the tool suite and troubleshooting, will find in Getting Started, the user gets to practice debugging code with errors. In What's Cool About Hue, the user is shown how to configure many key settings, how to navigate debugging, and how to use the integrated debugger features, as well as touching on some of the subjects of the other modules. The Performance Analysis module shows click-by-click -click how to analyze your code, and the I.O. Wizard module introduces the I.O. Wizard program, which comes with the kit, and generates code for the configuration bits of inputs, outputs, timers, and interrupts in your project. The Training Resources module contains links to specific training modules on renaissanceinteractive.com, and the Hue Target Server module describes how the Hue Target Server can be used to automate control of Hue during testing analysis of your design. Experiencing this tutorial program really gets the creativity flowing and motivates the user to start planning his or her next project. At the same time, it provides valuable information, useful for future designing, while making you comfortable using Renaissance parts and tools. Really, I'm serious. After going through this tutorial, I sat down and coded most of a small embedded systems project in about 45 minutes, using the advanced tools that I was introduced to by the Subatomic Particle Board. Thank you and have a great day.